Welcome back UNF Osprey fans. Today we kind of take you a little bit on a trip with us up to Myrtle Beach, South Carolina where the Ospreys will play in the Carolinas Challenge tomorrow night against Coastal Carolina. Coach Tathmeyer, how's it feel to be in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina? Well, I haven't seen the ocean yet, but um, that might be a trip this afternoon. We had practice this morning, so we've got the afternoon to take in some sights and to enjoy Myrtle Beach. Now, you guys have come off a little bit of a rough week going one and two. I mean, what's, what do you guys need to do for this week and what's kind of like the mindset right now? Well, I think every, every film evaluation that we have with the kids, we talk to them about certain things that we're looking for improvement in and we saw it this morning in practice. Um, we need to be the scrappier underdog team. That has to be our mentality every time we step on the floor. I thought we saw it um, in fits and spurts in our last game against Maryland Eastern Shore. We made a heck of a comeback, but we had to make it because we got 18 points down. We have to learn that a basketball game is 40 minutes, and um, we took a big hit the day before. Um, Kira came back for her first game and ended up hurting her knee. She's gone for the rest of the season, so it's time to rally the troops. We're going to have to say, have some other people step up. We made a couple of offensive adjustments, so we'll see how well we handle the adjustments. Now, we're playing at Myrtle Beach, just a few miles down the road from Conway, South Carolina, which is where Coast Carolina is based. But the game is billed as a neutral site since the Carolinas Challenge is put on by the city of Myrtle Beach. What does it feel like just to play pretty much essentially in Coastal's backyard, but it's still a neutral site game? Well, it's a neutral site game, but we will have the away uniforms on, and it's a site that they're familiar with uh, because they play in this event every single year. So it truly is a home court advantage for Coastal, just on a different court. They'll have fans, um, but I think, you know, it's just an opportunity. Ten points better than everybody else that you play against, and we have to be ready for a battle for 40 minutes because they are a very scrappy basketball team. Now, Coach, we came off the Holiday Classic, and we've got the holidays coming up, especially for your team. Holiday break coming up after tomorrow night's game. Got any holiday jokes for us? You came up with some for Halloween and for I, Thanksgiving. I think the biggest holiday joke is probably going to be on me. Uh, we've got 11 family members coming to spend Christmas with us, and I really haven't done much of anything. So when I get home Thursday morning at about two. I have to go in Christmas boat for a couple days. So the, probably the joke's on me that I wasn't very prepared and didn't do much down the stretch. But I'm excited about my family coming to town. Kind of like a Griswold's Christmas? Yeah, probably pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> well, Coach, thank you so much for taking out time of your day and enjoy the beautiful weather in Myrtle Beach. Thank you and happy holidays to everyone else.